even from your childhood, from your, you know, from some of your very first memories. Um, and being married, uh, and being back out in the world, you, you don't know how you're conforming until he reveals it to you. You don't know that you're in bondage until he opens your eyes, until he unplugs your ears, you can't hear his voice, you can't see the truth. So, you know, coming out of King Challenge, you know, I've been set free, I've been, I've been saved, I'm a new creation. But, we're back. So, but, coming out into the world, you know, you, you get conformed, and you don't know it. So, Quest, <laughs> what happened to Quest was, you know, even though I've been saved, I've been set free, and, and, and I'm a new creation, being in the world, you get... You start, things start clinging to your heart that you don't know are there. So like I said a minute ago, he reveals those things to you and then he's there to do heart surgery again. Amen. Yes. To remove those things and then the best part about it is, is that he fills it up with him. Yes. And then you're even more on fire. <laughs> than when you're, you know, so, so being, being saved and, and being a new creation doesn't stop there. Right. You gotta keep chasing him, keep listening to him, stay in his word, and, and you'll continue to be set free, and, and people will see that light in you, and it'll just spread like yes. fire. So, so that's that's what Quest does, and Quest brings men together, uh, and then, you know they go through these things together, and they, you know they're able to confess things to each other, and that's where the Iron sharpens iron, and so one man sharpens another. So you know you get to sit and watch other men being, being set free. So so your faith is growing just from watching that, from watching men come in with their head down or a hat pulled over their eyes, and then a day or two later, the hat's off, the eyes are open, and you can see into their soul, and all of a sudden their 